JC, stop talking on the phone and do your project! We're gonna get this agenda passed unless we have Councilman Jeffers on board. Mm-hmm. Lorraine, can you hold on for a sec? I have another call coming in. Hello? Yes, this is her mother. What? Can you hold on for a moment? Lorraine, I'm gonna have to talk later. It's someone from JC School. It's a situation I have to deal with. Okay, all right. Hello? So you were saying JC's been selling things to other children? What kind of things is she selling? Okay. No, thank you for calling. All right. Thank you. Bye-bye. I can hear the music, it's damaging your ears. Good, then I wouldn't have to listen to you. Sit down. I got a call from your principal. JC, a little sick and tired mom? of all these incidents happening. Um, I'm mom? not finished yet. But mom? Show me some respect, young lady! As I was saying, you've become really remote lately, JC. I have to be on top of you for everything. But- First you lose interest in school. You used to be an A student. But then you're never home. I don't know where you are half the time. And now I get a call from your principal? What's going on with you? Why are you taking money from other kids? Well? Can I talk now? Yes. And you'd better. It was supposed to be a surprise. Well, color me surprised. Well, what's the surprise? Your birthday. It's just, you're away so much and you're at work. And I never get to see you anymore. So I was saving up for a spa day for us. Oh, sweetheart. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I do work too much. I'm sorry, JC. I'm just, I'm just trying to create more opportunities for you. Opportunities that I never had. And it just, sometimes it seems impossible. But that's, that's nothing for you to worry about. Okay? That's my job. Do you want to help me make dinner? Yeah. On second thought, maybe we should just... 